Is your computer running slowly? Does it take forever to start up? Does it just act weird? It might be a repair costing hundreds. It could be a virus or malware that can really cause you problems. There is a slight chance you have some hardware in your computer causing it. I have seen it all in my 10 plus years of solving computer problems, but I have a solution. Before you take your computer to the repair shop, follow my seven simple secrets to make your computer run faster first. Here's the best part. It's free. It's simple. It's safe. Just go to RemoteTechAssistance.com for free step-by-step -step instructions on what to do. That's RemoteTechAssistance.com or click on the link in the description below. How's it going everybody? I'm going to show you how to use a sample video and turn it into an animated GIF using Microsoft PowerPoint. Using a sample video to make an animated GIF in PowerPoint is as easy as making a generic animated GIF. Although, there are a couple of things you need to consider when doing this. First of all, you want to check the length of that video. In this case, this video is 3.05 seconds. So now all we got to do is create the GIF. First, we go into File, and then we go into Export. And then we want to create on create an animated GIF, not create a video, but we want to click on create an animated GIF. So we want to click that. And even though a lot of phones or some videos are nowadays done in 4K, the highest resolution you can use in PowerPoint is 1080p. Now, the seconds spend on each slide Instead of an interval like you're going through multiple slides, you want to match how long the sample video is with what you have right here. So we're going to do that and we're going to click on create GIF. And then I'm going to name this video GIF. And it takes longer to produce with the video as opposed to making a simple animated GIF, as you can tell. So now the animated GIF is done, we can go look at it. So let's click here. does take a while to load since it's a big file. Now when it comes to making animated GIFs, you'll see that it loops over and over. You can't do it one time. But other than that, that's how you use a video sample to make an animated GIF. Just like making an animated GIF in general using Microsoft PowerPoint, it's easy to do the same thing with the sample video. Thank you for subscribing. Please be sure to like this video and check out some of my other videos too.